Poppin' people, welcome back to another episode of Kicking Their Bass TV. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, also hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. If you guys haven't seen one of my recent videos, me and Alan Bob and Cody, we went out surf fishing and caught some really big reds. If you guys want to go check out that video, I'll link it down below. It's a banger. But in today's video, we're actually going to be fishing with swim baits for whatever bites. That's the game plan today. I actually have it on a spinning combo and this is the kicking their bass combo. These actually drop October 28th, which I believe is in like six, five, six days. Um, so stay tuned for that. Put it on your calendar. It's actually this Thursday coming up um, that the kicking combos will be dropping. So keep that in mind. But yeah, we just have a little jig head with a swim bait on it. Very clean and basic. Um, on my reel, I just got some braid and then I have a fluorocarbon leader. And yeah, we're just gonna be casting this around, trying to catch some bass, trying to catch some mudfish, catfish, um, crappie, striper, flounder, redfish, really whatever bites we're gonna go for today. We're fishing brackish water, so I think we have the opportunity to catch multiple species. So we're gonna go ahead and hop into this, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you wanna see more content like this, hit the like button, let your boy know down below. Let's hop right into it. One thing I didn't think about flounder is like trolling motor noise, vibrations. Like, how does that affect those fish? I, I'm not sure. Oh my God. I got one. I think it's a flounder. Yo, we just started. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's a mudfish. Don't even play. Oh, Cody, I was so excited, dude. I'm like, we've been here for probably, what, three minutes? And I was like, I'm hooked up, but we got us a little mud, man, on a, on a tiny swim bait man. on the old kicking combo. <laughs> oh, man, I thought I had me an old saltwater junkie. I feel like we're going to deal with a lot of that today. Okay. Not what we want. But? But he's a fish. <laughs> and to start us off in like what? What would you say, two minutes, Cody? Yeah, Three minutes? I mean, not even five, so. I threw a couple casts and got slammed. I thought it was a flounder too, just by the way it was fighting. I could tell it was fighting different. Than Dude, that. I was like, what? Yeah, I could I could easily tell. Like, I don't know, that's crazy. I felt that bite and then I hook set and it just didn't feel, I knew it wasn't a bass, dude. Like, it just felt weird. Yeah. I got one. Oh, it's a bass. Yeah. You got to say bass on this little swim bait. Little guy, nothing big, nothing crazy. A little healthy dude. Look how he ate that swim bait too. Oop. Right there in his mouth. Pretty little guy though. First bass today, you know, we caught, we got us a mud and we got us a bass. Um, two different species off the list today. Nothing big, but definitely a nice little bass to start off with in this pretty little canal. Thank you, buddy. Where would it oh my God. Oh, you got one too? I don't have one. Wait, what happened? <laughs> did you get hit? I, I don't think so. What did you catch? <laughs> I'm gonna have, we're gonna have to go over there and get this one. Dude, I don't know what I just caught. <laughs> Dude, 
this is my thing. We only got two fish, but they're both different species. I want to see like, dude, I'm going to be honest. Like, I don't know how sandbars work with those things, mm -hmm. but like, you know, that big sandbar here, maybe they like oh, yeah. get on this. Yeah, I will say, dude, it's really hard to tell if you have a bite or not. Uh, yeah, because the way I've been popping it too, I haven't been keeping like pressure. So I kind of like lift up and just feel weight. But then again, a couple times I felt weight. It was just the bottom. Yeah, that song goes hard. Got him? Bass. Crazy dog. Crazy doggy. Dude, this kicking setup feels so good, bro. I, guys, I don't uh, fish with a spinning rod too often, but today uh, <laughs> we're making it happen with it. And this freaking thing, he's not a bad one, dude. Ah, oh, he's small. They're just fat. <laughs> that swim bait is catching him, man. Pretty little bass. Nothing big. I, I was hoping it was gonna be something different. So now we have two bass and a mudfish. We're gonna keep track today. So me and Cody were just riding to the next spot. Our plan now is to kind of go more salty. You know, we're in heavy brackish right here. We It's still gonna be brackish water. I think we can still catch some bass where we're going because last time, you know, Cody hooked the bass. But uh, we're about to move around, just hit some different stuff. Just try some very, like stuff that's just out there that we don't know anything about. And I just wanna see what we'll catch. You know, I wanna see how many species of fish we'll catch today. We're just tossing around that swim bait for really whatever bites. Um, I'd really like to see a flounder today. A redfish would be dope. Uh, we already have bass off the list. We already have uh, mudfish. Mudfish off the list. I don't really know what else we'll catch. Maybe a trout if we if we go down more. Um, I'd like to see some more bass in today's video, but I think we're gonna go down and then come back up and then hit that spot when it's about right. So we're just gonna cover some water, hit a bunch of different locations that we haven't hit before, and just really work this bait good and see if we can catch some good fish today. Oh, dude, there's probably some slabs. But um, this is my thing. It's like any of these indentions, bends. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, is that a red? Dude, no way, Cody. No way, Cody. I think I got a red, dog. There's no way this is a mud. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's a massive mud, dude. I thought I had a red fish. I was about to get so excited. Oh, you little stinker. <laughs> Are you big stinker, really? Did you see him when he jumped? Yeah. Did you think it was a mud? No, I didn't. I, I don't know what. I thought it was a giant gar or something. It Woo! Was so big. Hey, let me grab you the fire. Yeah. We already had you off the list, bud. I, dude, I really thought I had a good redfish. I was about to start freaking out, dude. <laughs> That's still fun to catch, though. We're catching anything today, so anything's fun. Jeez. That's a big one. <laughs> that is a big boy. Right on that little swim bait, man. I, when I hooked set, I just saw him go like this. I was like, oh my gosh. I thought I had a red, dude. That would have been sick, but two muds, two bass, right? Yep. Two muds, two bass. Keep the going. way he was running, I just didn't think he was a mud. Like, he was just to tearing towards us. And I'm like, dude, this is actually a 20-inch redfish. It's actually bumping, dude. This is just catchy. It's not really bumping. It's just catchy. Yeah. It's cringy catchy. Oh, I got a fish. Bass. It's a bass. What the? Okay. <laughs> is this three bass or four bass? Oh my god, it's the fattest three little bass. turd I've ever caught. <laughs> Look at that. 
Dude, that is a future 25 pounder, bro. I swear. <laughs> Look at that. What? That's so cool, though. <laughs> All right, three bass, two muds. God, you had it too, buddy. I never moved it. I just threw it in that little current break, and he was there. Look at that. That is a Big Mac if I know of one. Them bass out here, man. It's all them crabs mm -hmm. and crab belly bass. <laughs> that was cool. Whoa, there he goes. Dude, that was cool. I, I swear, guys, these bass out here are just another breed. Like, you don't catch many, like, monsters, but <laughs> I'm telling you, man, they, the bellies on these fish, I don't know any other fishery that has fat, bass as fat as they are out here. Ah, it's crazy to me. You got one? A bass? Yeah. Nice. Skipped it right up there, dude. For no reason. I didn't have to skip. I was you just, just practicing. Picked up on it. It's a pink bass. That's why he ate the pink. Let's Good see. It. Kind of pink on his stomach. On an electric chicken. On the electric chicken. The old electric chicano. That was my first. I had a bite this whole time we've been out here. First bite? First bite, first fish. First he bite. just loaded up on it, didn't he? Yep. I was saying too, this should be a good bass spot. Get hooked. Freaking good looking rock. Action up there. Out? Yeah. Is that a boil to that or is that current? I think it's either current or something sitting there. Oh. No. -uh. Yep. Bass? bass? Really? I was about to say there I was Literally about to say, how is there not a fish right there? Yeah, it's the smallest bass I've caught in forever. Look at that little thing. Smallest bass we've seen out here. <laughs> oh, you got one? No, dude. If I had a fish <laughs> there, I had a fish. Fish, fish. Still pretty. Yeah. Gotta appreciate the fish. But I want to see a flounder too. Wait, wait, what do we got? I think it's a flounder, dude. Not even kidding, I think this is a flounder. That's a bass, are you kidding me? <laughs> it's a bass. Are you really not kidding? No, I actually thought it wasn't fighting like a bass, dude. I was like, man, I got me something different. It's funny, right before I hook set, I was about to say something, I was like, dude, I was like, I'm feeling it, I'm gonna get a bite. And then all of a sudden I never came out of my mouth, but I did get a bite. It's gonna be so hype though. Just knowing that we're catching bass like right where these other fish are. At least that's what we think. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like it's coming, Cody. The third species is about to be caught in the next five, 10 minutes. He just didn't, did not fight like a bass. Like, yeah. but then again, every fish is fighting weird because I don't throw a spinning rod. So it's like, everything does feel a lot different to me. But you would think like something of some sort would be, oh, I just got hammered. That's a big bass, dude. Or not big, but I mean a good one. Best fish today. Why are we smoking bass right here, dude, on swim baits? We might've just found like the new sauce. Well, we got another bass. What is that, bass number seven? Yep. Not complaining. We're hitting all new spots today, guys. We're like, we're in some very thick marsh. Very pretty scenery. This sucker thumped it good. 
I knew there had to have been a fish up there. I think we might catch another one here in a second on this point. It just kind of makes sense. Very shallow water. My boat's sending one foot of water and he was up there. But be careful when you're up there because it's really thick, but it, I think it's like a, a shell bed or oyster bed is a better term out here, I think. You'll feel it, it's really rough. But then again, that makes sense for something to sit up there. Yeah. There he is. Uh-oh. Dude, big boy Cody. This is not a bass. This, this might be a flounder dog on the oyster bed. It is. It is. It is. is it? No, it's a catfish. What? what? I caught a catfish. That's perfect, Cody. Third species. Yeah. <laughs> I snagged him in the back. I knew he felt just some type of way, dog. All right, we caught two muds, a catfish, and a bunch of bass. <laughs> Look at the slime on me. So is this a saltwater cat or is this a... No, that's just a normal cat. cat. Channel cat, huh? I think so. Third species. Dude, he was right there on that oyster bed. That's crazy. I, I swore that I had a red or a, a flounder or a trout. Dude, that just didn't fight. But it's because I had him in the booty. Yeah. But it just made sense right there. I was like, man, there's these oyster beds. You would think that you'd catch a saltwater fish, but no. <laughs> Old caddy. Oh gosh, that was a bite. I just pulled it out of something's mouth, dude. Oh gosh, dude, huge boil. Dude, he's chasing me. Oh no. Dude, big fish, Cody. I don't know what it was, dude. It could have been a, like a red or something. Or a bass, I, I don't know anymore. All I know is he hit me the catch before and I throw in there and he's chasing something on this corner. I pulled it out of his mouth the first cast. Well guys, we are about to close off today's video. We had a blast, man, coming out here, fishing with a little jig head and swim baits. It was a lot of fun. You know, we never knew what was gonna bite our bait. I really wanted to catch a flounder today, like really bad, um, but we just didn't have the opportunity. I don't know if we're fishing the wrong spots, if we're fishing the wrong tide, if we're using the wrong bait, if we're retrieving it the wrong way. There's so many little factors that come to catching different types of fish and uh flounder is just one of those fish that i have never targeted never fished for if you guys have any suggestions please leave them down in the comment section because we're definitely going to come back out try to catch you know some reds some flounder maybe even some striper so if you guys have any tips for us please let me know i just had a bite and that scared me But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We got another bass right here. If you did, please hit the like button. I love you guys so much. And I'll catch y'all in the next video.